channel so today's video is going to be a kind of like a chit chat get ready with me um, or like a QA and a because I don't really have much questions but yeah I'm just gonna be getting ready and talking to you guys and um, my name is Nita and if you're new to this channel make sure to subscribe and let's go right into the video so to start off we're just gonna like do my eyebrows and then I'll like tell you guys because last time I recorded this was like last like June or something that was the last time I recorded like one of these actually no I recorded a get ready with me at the beginning of this year, like school year, but it wasn't really a chit chat. I was kind of just like a get ready with me, and I really do want to like talk to you guys because it has been so long. But then the thing about these videos is that I feel like you guys don't like them because I talk so much. But I mean that is the point of the video, so I'm just gonna like start. So we're starting off with my um, Anastasia Debra pomade in dark brown, and I'm just gonna, like my natural brows. And guys, do you see my skin right now? Like, hold on. Like, there's some blemishes, but it's like nothing too big. But my skin looks so good, and I'm so happy. Um, I started using this, uh, what is it called? Like a Mary Ruth B12. It's like this hair, skin, and nail, like they're droppers. And they're just like so amazing. I've been using them for maybe like a week, and honestly, I've seen so much good results. Like, I'm supposed to be doing my makeup, but I really do want to talk to you guys. So like look at my nails. Okay, well that one's messed up. But like if you look at them, look at how long they are. You guys can't it won't focus. Look at the length of my nails. They're so healthy. Like before I started taking these drops, my nails would break so so often because I just have like really bare nails and like the stuff I do it just like it makes them break. But they have not been breaking. Oh, that's way too. Uh, they have not been breaking my hair looks so good um I haven't cut my hair in like about a year almost no like over a year pretty much because I cut it last February that was the last time I cut it and I did want to cut it again like I was really tempted to cut it again but I was like no I like I really do want to let it grow out so I'm trying to let it grow because like I love my long hair but it's just it gets so hot and it's like so not hard to take care of because it's like easy but it's just easier having short hair like I don't have to like like shampoo as much hair it's just easier having short hair but I mean I really do like long hair but I feel like short hair makes me look older but then it's like I look young all the time so <laughs> but yeah I just want to talk to you guys I, I had questions asked but uh, let me see let's look at these questions I'm talk I'm gonna be talking so much in this video. It's gonna be like 25 minutes. <laughs> okay, so one of the questions I feel like some of these questions are the same as last time, but I'm not trying to repeat them. Um, because in the last video I made, I got this question, but I mean I'll just answer it again. Um, the question was, do you want more kids in the near future? Not in the near future. Not for like five, six years. Not until I'm done with college, and that's not for five years. So yeah. Mm, I mean, I don't know if. That's definitely not near future, but it's something. But I definitely do want more kids. I just, I just like really want to finish school and just like continue on with life. And I don't want to. Yeah, I just no. Not anytime soon. Um, another question was the best thing about being a teen mom. Hmm. I mean, there's a lot of good things about being a teen mom. Or that just makes it sound like I'm trying to like yeah go get pregnant. No. Um. But like, if there were to be the best thing about being a teen mom, I feel like my age, um, because I'm so young, I feel like it kind of helps me more to be able to keep up with Mateo because Mateo is a crazy baby, and he is very energetic. And honestly, he he keeps me energetic. And I mean, I don't really know. Like, that's a hard question. I never even thought about this. But yeah, I think maybe being young, maybe. Another one was, does Mateo sleep through the night? No. No, he does not. But, um, there is this class that I've heard about. Everyone swears by it. It's like this taking care of babies class. Um, she's like an Instagrammer and she has like this course and it basically helps you to be able to like help your baby sleep through the night, like even young, like 12 hours. And, but it's like two, three hundred dollars and I'm like, it's probably worth it, but I'm fine for now. Okay, guys, <clears throat> I really had to do my eyebrows off camera. I was, like, talking too much, and I just, like, need to focus. Um, yeah, 
yeah, you guys see them? I feel like they look so thick. But then I like put makeup on and they look fine. Okay, back to what I was saying. So, with everything that's like honestly been going on with like all this quarantine stuff and like COVID. Oh, first I made an like Instagram account for Mateo. So I want you guys to go follow that. Um, I'm going to leave like the, the handle right here. Next is I have started working out. I know guys, I'm so proud of myself. I just honestly was like tired of just like being so unproductive because I realized now that like there's no more school that I honestly did nothing. Like I would go to school and I'd come home, do homework and then I'd char. Like I didn't really do anything. And since I'm in PE, only reason I'm in PE is because I didn't take a freshman year because my old high school didn't require it, but my new high school does require it. So I'm a junior in a freshman class and it's really annoying because it's like so many of the girls are like, oh, anyways, we're just like not going to get into that guys. Oh, I'm using the, the Bretman Rock X Color Pot Pop Lip Palette. And I use my Pro Conceal in Porcelain, the concealer, for my eyebrows. And I'm just like putting it everywhere. And I remember last time I filmed one of these, someone like commented and they were like, oh, like you're using the wrong brush. And I was like, well, it still came out good. And I've said this before, I'm not a makeup guru. Only reason I do these get ready with me's is because like I really do want to like talk to you guys. So I'm sorry if I'm not doing it correct, if I am irking your souls with how I do my makeup. But, I mean, you don't have to watch, so. Anyways, I've been working out, trying to stay proactive. So, like, every day I've been going on, like, mile runs. I have been doing these workouts. I do a workout for my legs twice a day and then for my abs three times a day. And you guys are like, oh, my God, that's, like, so much. But, honestly, it's kind of just, like, it's, it's basically just the reps of them. I just separate them because I feel like that's easier for me, personally. And I have a lot of new YouTube videos coming, guys. I'm so excited. So I have this one going up. Hopefully soon, my get ready with me. There was another one of the like the famous TikTok whipped coffee, and I tried filming yesterday, but it was a total fail. I just like didn't do it right. So I'm gonna redo it and do it correct this time, and then I'm gonna have that one up for you guys. I'm also going to be recording a workout routine. I want to record it because I just like want you guys to see. And no, I'm not. Like, um, I'm not a physical trainer, like I don't know, and my form is probably gonna be so bad in the video, but I mean, I just really want you guys to see what I do and like how I'm trying to stay proactive like in this quarantine. And honestly, I'm really proud of myself because even before this, I just was like never this proactive, but I feel like being at home made me realize like, oh my God, like I really don't do anything with my life. And I was just like, I'm tired of it. Cause I used to do soccer. And that was basically like my, my fitness. Like that's what I would do to work out and like stay fit and stuff. But I just like didn't do soccer anymore because I didn't have the time. That. I'm just gonna keep talking, I'm sorry guys. If you don't like it, skip, 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 skip. But there is, oh wait, there's something I wanna record and it's my intro. I wanna do like a professional, like good intro because on this video you saw the new intro with like the new song and pictures but I want to do one where it's like an actual intro where it's like I want to probably just like be in the backyard with Mateo um we got like this bubble machine and just like take a video of like me and him playing put in like slow-mo like put some music montage it make it all look good because I think it would look so good and my channel has been growing kind of I'm at like 4200 which is still a lot though um I have like seen this picture from a couple months ago where I was barely at 200 and I was like, oh my God, like my channel's grown so much. When I talk to you guys, I just like get lost because I talk about everything and it's probably the most annoying thing ever. But I'm sorry guys, I'm just like, I really like this channel. I love you guys, you guys are so sweet. I get so many messages like just like, and I haven't even been posting and it's still people like swiping up and like, texting me and like asking questions and stuff and I'm like I feel so honored that you guys ask me questions because I don't really see myself as like that like oh my god like I'm so big but you guys are just so sweet and I'm like wow like this is so crazy like this whole journey and everything you can't even see it guys I'm doing my makeup terrible I just like 
want to get it done. Yeah, with, so <clears throat> I just finished putting my lashes on. Now that I notice, they look very like up. Um, and why they look like very curled is because I curled them before. I honestly have found that it helps a lot. So there's another little hack for you. I think so. Now that my eye makeup is all done, I'm going to be showing you guys this like TikTok hack, hack I found. I cannot talk today. So I'm gonna grab my translucent powder. I'm gonna make sure it's not at the top. Oh, this makes such a mess. I hate translucent powder. Okay, and then you're going to, I'm sure you guys can already like imagine what I'm gonna do. So there's too much on the top. So I'm just gonna, I'm just a little. You literally just put it all over your face. I'm gonna put the, like the steps on how to do this. In the description box so if you guys have any like if you guys get lost in the thing if you want to come back to it yeah so I'm just gonna be taking it's just literally just the elf makeup mist and set and you just like spritz your face so I'm gonna put so much oh my lashes and then you let that dry and then I got stuff in it. Um, yeah you let that dry you like my washing shirt I've been recently um, reminiscing on wash you and like how much I miss it because it's crazy because it's been almost a year since I've gone and it was definitely one of the best experiences of my life and honestly I'm really happy I got that like I, I vlogged my channel has been up for almost a year in in June in early June it'll be a year and I just think that's crazy because I feel like it hasn't been a year and when Mateo turned one I was like wow like this is just so surreal. So what you're gonna do next is you're just gonna take your primer, whatever primer you use. I use the e.l.f. Poreless Face Primer. And I'm gonna have all the like products I used in the description box, just in case you guys were wondering like what I used or something. And then you're just gonna put that all over your face. And I feel like this kind of helps because it kind of puts like, it, it's like a dry base for my face because my face is very oily. So putting the translucent powder and then the, the spray helps so that there's not like flashback because if you just put translucent powder, it'll be, there'll be flashback because it's under. From there, I'm just gonna do my, I'm just gonna do my foundation. So, I will see you guys when I'm done with my foundation. Yeah, so I finished my foundation and right now I'm just setting. I look crazy. Um, it's been setting for like two minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and just, what I do, I kind of just like blend it in and then I set it again with setting spray, just like to make sure that there's no like powder everywhere and it looks weird. <clears throat> we're gonna take the same setting spray just set that really nicely so now that that's kind of done I'm going to be putting just mascara on my bottom lashes so I'm using the Colossal Volume Express Maybelline mascara this is probably my holy grail drugstore product honestly this is just amazing I feel like it gets your lashes really long and I also like the telescopic one I've recently started or not recently but like I started using it more. So I finished my mascara. I'm gonna try and show you guys. I don't know if you guys can see, but I really like that mascara. I will start with the yellow one and I'll just like put this and then I put a little bit of this and just like try kind of uh, try to like lengthen them. So now that pretty much everything is done, I'm about to be done. I hope this video is not a flop, but I'm using the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette, Contour Palette. As you can see, this is definitely my favorite shade. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on my jawline. Now that my contour is done, I don't even contour, like it's like a very soft contour. Um, <clears throat> I take my Bretman Rock <coughs> Babe in Paradise Highlight Palette, and I just mix these, the Vagation and Get Laid. Okay, and then the last thing I do is just, I get like a small, like an angled brush. And I just, I think it's this one that I get. Just put that in my inner corner. And I don't put too much because I do have that, um, like the shadow on the on the lid already. Just a little bit in the, on the brow bone, just like to make it look better. I'll probably top it off. This is my exposed Kylie lip liner. It's probably my favorite and I use it a lot. That's why it's so small. Okay, so I just lined my lips and I'm gonna take the exposed Kylie, and I only put a little bit because this stuff does not come off like it will stay so literally just a little bit and I kind of put in like dots all around and then that is pretty much the finished look 
I'm gonna go curl my hair, but I'm just gonna end this video here because I need to hurry. So yeah, this is it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you are even here still. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any comments, make sure to comment them down in the comments below. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and go follow our Instagrams. Bye.